right, thank you for staying with the Monday Report. Let's see some of your feedback before we take closing remarks from my guest. Let's bring up the first one on Twitter, Trevor Mbidja, Citizen TV Kenya. Use the hashtag Monday Report. Steve Ogola says to win the presidency, Baba needed to consolidate former NASA voting bloc and work to get appreciable support from Mount Kenya. With Mudavadi and Wetangula gone and Mount Kenya looking perilous, you'd have to stretch optimism to breaking point to see how Baba will win this thing. Okay? Let's see what else you're saying here. Skipper says, because Simeha is denying that DAPK has not run over ANC and Ford Kenya parties with several recent defections of elected MPs from those two parties, ask him how many MPs does both Musali and Wetangula still have currently as they merge with UDA? Okay, you will take that question and respond to it as you mm -hmm. close up. Moses Kim Ngetich says, I think there's a freedom of choice. Mudavadi has not made a wrong decision. The One Kenya Alliance hasn't been swept completely. There's still Kanu and Wiper leaders who can still run the alliance, okay? Conrad Kulo says, UDANC union has indeed changed the political terrain as it stands. Orca's odds of survival have been cut by half. Kalonzo Gideon force is not ample to defy the two presidential front runners. Kalonzo has to make up his mind. UDA or Azimio, okay? Victor says Mudavadi's political career is in limbo. His presence in UDA is inconsequential in Western Kenya. Okay. Nyantika Chester says it depends on how one would like to look at it, but deep down their hearts, the duo, Simeha and Dr. Muluka, know that DAPK is the party to watch in the Mulembe Nation in 2022. And you can't just write off the likes of Atuoli and the Governor Paranya and the others. <laughs> When Naomi Michael says, Oka is still strong. Even if it remains with Gideon Moy alone, we shall still support it. We are after political ideologies, but not politicians' faces. Okay? Philip Ntemi says, constructively destructive. Wow. What a game. But Oka is done and dusted. Let's see how the politics will now play out. It's a game of strategies. May the best team win. Marco Seno says, the exit of Nabulindo, Kaunya, Savula, who are sitting MPs, and Marende from Vihiga County cannot just be wished off. No single political party has lost this kind of numbers recently. They can't be inconsequential only when they leave. Okay? Njoroge Jr. says, I don't think Mudavadi has a lot of impact in UDA, but let's wait and see after Wednesday's Nakuru joint rally. Barak, I'll come to you now to, to hear your views on what... Most of them have talked about. Where does this leave the Mount Kenya formation? You alluded to it earlier on. Yes, uh, thank you very much. I think the mountain is uh, extremely critical. It's got uh, the numbers and uh, whoever it votes with uh, preponderantly is uh, likely to carry the day. And uh, saying that, therefore, I would hesitate to dismiss uh, anyone. One of uh, the people who have responded has said something to the effect that uh, Baba is finished you know, without um, Davadi and uh, Wetangla. He certainly loses very significantly the kind of backing that uh, he had uh, in Western, regardless of uh, what uh, ardent uh, supporters may do by way of wishful thinking. He has lost uh, ground significantly in Western, uh, but he is also gaining some ground in uh, Central, in the mountain. We have to wait and see what kind of traction that is going to be. Okay. It's also impertinent, I think, to dismiss um, Davadi, to say that uh, he is inconsequential in uh, Western. There are people here in Western, and I live in Western. I'm even now talking to you from Western. This is a Manudia, if you haven't been here. This is a Manudia where I'm, I'm talking from. Yeah. And uh, the people around here have been saying we are waiting for Mdavadi to give us direction. And whatever he tells us is what we are going to do. So we have to wait and see whether they are going to live up to that word, yeah. or whether they're going to dissuade away from him. We, we don't know. Okay. Uh, DAP, as I have said, is not a homegrown entity. DAP is uh, traveling on uh, sponsored mileage. It is uh, a quisling uh, entity, a quisling uh, uh, vessel that has got uh, its owner somewhere. 
And yes, it's true that even those whistling entities sometimes float yeah. and uh, they, they, they travel. So let's wait again and see how far they go. Okay. But ultimately, as my last word, uh, Trevor, yeah. uh, this is increasingly a two-horse race. I don't know who the flag bearers are going to be. They look like they are Raila Odinga and uh, William Ruto. But I do not know what kind of uh, arrangement Mdavadi would have with Ruto. Maybe they are going to say to one another, you run as president, I also run as president. But uh, if there's a rerun, then we will work together. You will okay. support me. Okay. Simea, final words? Yeah, I think you're from just from based on the feedback I've had. First of all, I, I'm normally extremely hesitant, you know, to make any responses to elders. And at all, is a lawyer elder, whom um, automatically, whether I like it or not, have to, you know, give tremendous respect, just by virtue of him being an elder. But uh, when I grow old and become an elder, I'm already an elder. I, <laughs> but when I, when I become an older elder, yeah. I wouldn't like to be <laughs> such a, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that's an oxymoron. <laughs> I wouldn't like to be such a, a, a petty elder who talks about other men's manhood, you know, denigrates women and so on in public. Because I know in my, in my community, in, in the Luya community, yeah. there are things you don't, you, come on. I mean, you would have had to be so Sorry, I, I, will, I will stop Leave there. I, yes. I, there would have to be something wrong with you okay. to talk about certain things of other men yeah. and women in public. So I, I would never want to go there. I would never even want to, to respond. Talking about number of MPs lost by ANC, I think if there's a party that has lost MPs in this country is um, Jubilee, has lost, um, I think, in excess of 100 MPs. Yeah. Uh, I don't hear the same, the same questions being asked. Uh, ODM has also lost uh, MPs, and it's very normal around this time, you know, not only MPs but other players, other important actors, these parties have lost, this, these things happen, these realignments happen around elections. Yeah. The focus of ANC is to win the support of the people, and is the people then to give ANC, okay. pa you know, MPs, MCAs, senators, governors, and a president. Yeah. So e even when we lose, and sometimes in some cases it's actually even just a, a good riddance, especially where there hasn't been commitment. I mean, look at Savula. Who, yeah. who would want to have Savula in his party, that kind of character? Okay. E to me, honestly, and this is just a Simeha, a person. Who would want to have a character like Savula in their party? You'd rather th that he's say uh, whatever else, you know, where his motivation, the motivation responds to is, is something else, but not yeah. commitment to a cause. And finally, okay. the, the ANC party and Msaliam Davari and the region of Western, uh, which is not what is ANC is limited to, and Msaliam is not limited to, to Western, but yeah. is a starting base, I, I, con I confess that, is to work towards gaining the support of the people for now and for the future, not for a fatalistic short-term now or never presidential run, yeah. but for transforming the Republic of Kenya, the politics of Western, the politics of Kenya, and the Republic of Kenya. So we are not going to say that uh, we either get this now, yeah. or if we don't, we are going to die or something like that. Okay. No, it's much broader than just positions that people want to, you know, throw up all manner of dust about. It's uh, 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 and um, very finally, yeah. uh, we are going to present to Kenyans a Msaliam Davadi that they haven't seen before. Okay. This is a different kind of Msaliam Davadi. All right, we have to leave it there. Joseph sir, Simeha, thank sir. you so much for making time and dog and Barak Muluka as yes. well. It's a political analytical view of the movements that's happening. That's where we leave it for now. My name is Trevor BJ. It's always a pleasure having you with us here on the Monday Report. Remember, like we always say here at the Royal Media Services family, all we advocate for is peace. Your neighbor and your brother will remain exactly that. Politics is a game of numbers and a game of people shifting here and there. Politics is not enmity, people. Good night.